How are you, Brenda? No. I'm Jean Christophe. I Good morning. No. Well, I'm here. Anyway, I'm here to give you some TLC. I'm going to cook you a, a wonderful dish. Can I come in? <laughs> I don't it. It's just so overwhelming, really. Um, nobody's ever done anything like this, so it's, it's just wonderful. He's as handsome as he is on the television. <laughs> Richard and Judy sent me over because apparently you had uh, some kind of a problems on your way to holiday. Yes, we was going to uh, Grenada for a lovely 10-day holiday and uh, I was stupid enough to fall over my suitcase and um, broke my shoulder. I'm going to try to give you a bit of TLC. That's okay. my mission. I'm going to cook you one of the most amazing lasagna. Mm. I made it with a specific cheese, which is camembert cheese. Sounds wonderful. Excellent. Wonderful. Well, well, you sit down, you put your feet up, and then I'm going to crack on in your kitchen. My lasagna take three stages. The first one is the tomato pulp without any seeds, without any skins. And what I want is to use a very hot pan and put the tomato like this. Beautiful time. And what I want to do now is just to add some herbs, which is very beneficial. Now, next, I'm going to put some bay leaves. I'm going to stick that into the pan. And that, hopefully, should be the foundation of the tomato sauce. Now, I'm going to use some olive oil, then some chopped shallots. Like this. You only keep your shallots in the pan until they're soften. Then next, the mince. Beautiful meat, look at this, beautiful color. Now, I want to make sure that everything starts to exchange the juice, the flavors, and a little bit of colors. Never forget to season, especially when you're cooking meat. In general, people use wine and stock to cook the lasagna. I'm gonna show you a tip. Only use a good red wine, nice and fruity. Now, the wine is cooking very slowly. The mint is gonna start to absorb the wine and it's going to allow the mince to expand like sponge and that's what you want because if you want the right texture into your mince it's exactly the way you should do next we're going to make the white sauce we call it sauce bechamel right now the butter is now melted and what i want to do is to introduce the flour the flour and the butter is going to make some kind of a, a paste if i may say okay now the stock goes into the pan what i want to do is to add the double cream the cream is going to make it much softer. I suggest we don't boil the cream, by the way. This is a pure double cream. Now, you can see there is a bit of liquid into it, but also some resistance from the thickness, which is perfect. Right, now it's time to introduce the wonderful camembert cheese. What I suggest you do is to leave it in the freezer for 10 to 15 minutes, no more. You don't want to freeze the inside. You just gently freezing the outside where the skin is. That means if it's hard, you can actually peel it and save a lot out of it. You're only peeling what you don't want to use. Just snatch the cheese in pieces like this. I'm gonna use nutmeg. Nutmeg follow very well with cheese, by the way. And the texture is absolutely perfect. This is gonna be a foundation into the mince. We just managed to mingle the tomato into the mince and the flavor has exploded everywhere in the house. It's unbelievable. Now, let's have a try, a decisive try. Oh. Mm. Wonderful. You can see clearly the cheese is still melting slowly into the sauce. And what I want is to incorporate this. And this is gonna give a fantastic texture Brenda, can you please come over? How are you? Fine. Are you okay? Yeah. I'm gonna ask you to cook the lasagna. Right, we'll put that the one fruit, there. That's very good. Now, some lovely tomato oil into the pan. Okay. What I want is to drizzle this. Look at this. Right. Perfect, but well, you're doing very well. It's difficult to, uh, mm -hmm. to, uh, see, to separate the layers. Look at that. Just to garnish it like this, slowly. Mm -hmm. Perfect. Very good. Just like that. For that, can go like that. Last layer of pasta. The rest of the cheese. The smell of this is amazing. Now I'm putting some of the red oil as a matter of extra colors and flavors, and this is going to mix very well with the white sauce. Here we are. That's it. Finish. 
Therefore, I'm going to stick that in oven for 30 minutes at 160 degrees, okay? And perhaps I'll suggest that uh, you go and get ready. Uh -huh. And uh, perhaps we can have dinner together. Be yes, fantastic. Okay. Excellent. The lasagna with camembert cheese. It just put me at ease. He was charming. I feel a lot better today, yeah, and I should be thinking about this for months and months to come. We had a good time. We had a good laugh. I personally think we've done a fantastic job once again. It was lovely having him. I didn't really mind him messing my kitchen up. Mm -hmm.